So Dorkin has released brand new stages for the Doki Doki Heroin Battle event, stages four to six. Today, we're going to be doing stage four, as we can't really fit all three stages in one video this time around, since the new stages are actually quite difficult. Of course, we're going to be doing it with a free-to-play team, and I'll be completing the Peppy Girls mission, where you have to run four Peppy Girls in your team. So the fourth stage consists of versing physical launch here. And for her mechanic here, when she's in her purple hair form, she will have a high damage reduction rate, making it difficult for her to receive damage. And then when she sneezes and transforms into the blonde form, she's able to unleash a super powerful super attack. In this stage, you're actually allowed to bring one support item, which is going to be very helpful for us. So she has a total of 120 million HP with a 350 attack stat, 500,000 defense, 90% damage reduction, and she does three attacks per turn. Uh, and then if she does super attack you, it's 875,000 damage. Once she transforms into the blonde launch here, her attack rises to 900,000. And as you can see here, her super attack, which is a 50% chance of happening, is a 900 million damage super. I think that is the strongest super in the game um, by far, I think. <laughs> uh, but the one thing that you want to know is that you can stun, seal, uh, lower attack, lower defense, whatever that you need to do. Uh, you can do that to this launch. And then at a certain period of time, she goes back into the normal and then back into the um, blonde haired launch. So I'm going to show you guys today's run, which I did on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv forward slash jfanta, link in the description. If you guys do enjoy today's video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And let's get into the video. Boom and bang. Good enough. And then you use a ghost usher because I'm pretty sure it's a bit scary. All right, let's go. Attempt one on launch so launch can unleash a super mega damage which is roughly around 900 million all we need to do is stun i don't know when she activates it though i'm assuming after the charges are done <laughs> so we don't actually have to stun now it's the next turn but if it's all charges, then a Ghost Usher is, like, the greatest play. Oh, my God. She is so tanky as well. That's plus 2,000. <laughs> Got the stun good in lower attack we can do everything all right and then she'll go into this and she will definitely do a massive super attack so definitely want to do that And just avoid the blonde launch at all costs. It looks like though she is definitely much more vulnerable in this part of the battle. Yeah, she has a nine. She has a fifty-five percent damage reduction in this one, and in the other phase, it's ninety. So realistically, you want Videl here, but. And I got that. So, <laughs> sealable two. Yep. Oh. Run it. Okay, so it's not every single. Charge. I think we might die. Grace Heyman actually... Not good enough. <laughs> oh, 
But we get the seal. She, except she has a 900,000 attack stats. Oh! -hoo! Clutch! So now she's in this form. Let's go ahead and do this. So that will lower the attack. a random comment. It's doing chip damage and chip damage. Get a stun. Um, so we will go Stasha here. At least get the seal. Um, I think... It's a bit risky. Nah, I can't do that. Not yet. I don't feel like I have shot yet. I might regret it. Putting it in the last slot would have been... Way stronger, but I'm scared. Two... What up, what up? Three. Get the seal. Reset. Oh. All right, Chi Chi. Oh. Come on, Chi Chi. Yes. I got no more items. I need that stun. Chi Chi, it's the goat, man. And then we'll go back to the basic launch. Which one's your favorite chat? Purple hair or yellow hair launch? Mine personally is purple. Oh, no. oh, she's still in blonde hair form. Alright, come on. That's it. That's enough. That's gotta be enough. GG's. Oh, 
perfect.